I've been shocked by a story in the BBC News this week. It concerns a school in Oldham and the head teacher is reported as saying that she will have to withdraw the offer of school places for children who are potentially putting members of staff at risk due to breaches of COVID rules. This is in the context of schools offering children a vulnerable families and key workers education on site during the pandemic and it's reported that some of the children are talking to members of staff about their home life and giving indications that they have visited other families and seen more people than they should placing members of staff potentially at risk. It's a fundamental principle of education law, and it has been over many years, that children should not be punished for the actions of their parents. And it's a real concern if children will lose out on education places that they need because of parents not following rules. Indeed, there are very important regulations that govern school places and they say that there are only very limited exceptions when children should lose their school place, such as when a child is permanently excluded from school. And the reason why we have these principles and only very limited circumstances when children lose out on education is because it's well known that if children fall out of the education system, there are going to be poor outcomes for them. And indeed, there's the risk of those children being at harm. This is a week in which the Children's Commissioner has been very clear about the poor mental health of our children in light of the pandemic. In such circumstances, I think we need to be doing everything we can to support keeping our children in school and the article of what is going on in Oldham does raise significant concerns.